and welcome to my eBay listing. This will be for a Maserati 2004 4200 GT manual coupe. If you'd just like to follow me through, we'll do a, a bit of a walk around. We'll also have a look at the documents beforehand. So, here's the documents. First of all, we have um, two keys, all right, and the logbook. This is the, the V5. And if we open the logbook, you can see that the last owner has had it uh, a couple of years. He was a Navy pilot, actually. So he's had it two years, since August 2010. Um, number of former keepers, there were six. But that's not unusual for a car like this. Um, so there we are, the V5. Um, lots of service history, um, old invoices, old MOTs, that sort of thing. Um, the MOT... August this year, August the 10th this year. Um, as I say, we've got lots of um, servicing uh, invoices. Now, the actual service book, there it is. We flip through it. We got um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, as described in the listing. All right. Also, more documents. We have the owner's manual, uh, operating manual for how to operate the car. We also have the uh, uh, red, what they call code key for coding in the workshops, as and when necessary. We also have um, a master code key for electronic and mechanical coding. These two items are very important. But anyway, they live here in the nice leather wallet. Okay. Um, I'll just grab the keys. Okay. If you just like to follow me round, we'll start at the uh, driver's door. All right. So I'm going to look at the condition. I can't see any any scratches, dints, or dents. It looks good to me. Glass looks good. Follow me round. The mirror looks good. Condition. No signs of any scuffing. The front. Right wing looks very good condition, no signs of any damage, no chips, scratches or dents, looks good. Uh, let's have a look at the wheel. There's, putting my finger around the alloy wheel, there we go, all the way around. No scuffing at all, it looks perfect. Putting my finger on the disc, almost brand new. Hardly, I can't, kind of, just a tiny lip, hardly anything. It looks as if it's done no mileage at all, almost brand new. And a lovely shine to it, nice and smooth. Red calipers. The tyres, just put on my finger there, I would say hmm, about about three to four millimetres of tread. Just about half life, slightly under half life I'd say on that one. Half a life, just under. Follow me round. Let's have a look. Uh, the front bumper, no signs of any damage or chips or dents or scratches, looks good to me. Uh, little chip there, tiny chip where my fingertip is. Okay. And on my bonnet, on the bonnet, the odd chip. Little one there where my finger is there. Look, little couple there. That's about it really. So it looks very good condition. No signs of any damage or dents. Come and follow me around to uh, passenger side, front wing. Looks good condition. No signs of any damage, scratches or dents. Looks good. Um, lots of dust, mind you, but that's the uh, workshop it lives in. The uh, unit, you are the um, the alloy wheel. Putting my finger around the edge. Perfect condition. No signs of any scuffing at all. Putting my finger on the um, disc. Again, like the other side, almost brand new. Red calibers. By the way, don't do this if the car's just is just been uh, driving because it'll be quite hot. So look at the tread on the tyre. Mm, about the same as the other side, just under half life. Okay. Uh, follow me round. Looking at the windscreen now, looks good condition. Uh, no signs of any damage or chips or cracks or anything. Possibly a very slight little tiny one, not a chip at all, it's more of a sort of a touch. And possibly a tiny little one there, but doesn't um, affect anything at all. The uh, tax is uh, at the end of April this year. Follow me round the uh, door mirror, looks good condition, no signs of any damage. Passenger door, looks good, excellent condition, no signs of any damage. 
Uh, possibly a tiny little mark there where my finger is, about an inch or so, just there. But not a dent, just a sort of a touch, scuffy thing. But looks fine otherwise. Glasswork looks good. Follow me round rear wing. No signs of any damage. No accident condition or no chips, nothing like that. So I've got to get the rear wheels, right? Uh, put my finger around like we did on the front. Uh, no signs of any scuffing at all, looks perfect. Put my finger around there, looks brand new. Uh, perfect condition of the discs, red calipers. Uh, feeling the tyres, good tyres. They're about um, ooh, five millimetres, just under new. So well, about five, about three quarter life, I'd say. Five millimetres of tread left. Follow me round to the rear quarter. Uh, the rear, the um, bumper looks good. Got parking sensors there and there as well. Don't forget. On the boot, boot lid looks good, no signs of any damage, good condition. Rear glass looks good. Um, if I open it, now it can be opened with a button from the inside, but rather than me just go to the inside, I'll put the key in. You can also open it uh, manually like that. Here we go. There's the boot. Uh, nice and clean, no marks, no damage. And this compartment here lifts up. And inside here we got a toolkit, um, spare bulbs and bits and pieces like that, and uh, looks like one of these um, air compressors as well. Okay, I'll just put that back in like that. There we are. Follow me around. Parking sensors again, as I say. And the wing, uh, the rear, rear, rear wing. Looks good condition. No signs of any damage, scratches or dents. Looks good. Finally, this wheel, put my finger around the alloy again. No scuffs at all. So all four wheels are perfect condition. Discs, I can get my hand in there. Perfect. So all four discs are perfect condition as well. Red calipers, tires, like the other side, about three quarter life, five millimeters of trend. Twig. Okay, um, we'll have a bit of a look inside now. I won't go in, I'll just let you have a look. So put your head in, have a look. Yeah, well, have a look around a bit. No damage to the leather, all looks good. Um, possibly a slight, slight scuffing on the one of the bolsters, just there, but otherwise it's fine. This car's got the um, um, MSP as well. It's got pretty much every extra. It's got heated seats, memory seats, cruise control. It's got cruise control as well which um, all these are options. All right. Um, right, I'm just going to pop the bonnet a moment, so excuse me. There we are. So I'm going to turn my back on you. Follow me down, and we'll have a look at the engine compartment. So, you can just lift the bonnet. There we are. And there's the engine. Now, it's a Ferrari engine. See the red Ferrari? It's um, it's actually the same as the Ferrari 430. Right. Um, what can I say about it? It's powerful, fantastic condition in under here as well. This is where you um, there's your brake fluid, there's your washer, and under these panels is where you fill up with the oil. Okay, well there we go. I think that's enough for now. Um, thanks very much for watching. Goodbye.